hello welcome back to another pick a card reading so in today's pick a card reading we have the first pile that is gopal laddu gopal with this red color heart so if you're attracted to pile number one you can go for this and second pile we have gopal with bansuri and cow in the background and we have this golden color heart for pile number three we have krishna with this round charm if you're attracted to this pile number three you can go for this then we have pile number four with krishna's and cows in the background and we have this purple purple color charms and for pile number three sorry and this is pile number four pile number four we have radha and krishna together with this beautiful blue color charm heart she and the last pile is pile number six with this beautiful krishna with ganesh charm so if you're attracted to pile number six you can go for it if you need some more time you can pause the video and you can select your pile but i'm going to keep the give the time stamps in the description and if you want some more time you can pause the video so i will see you in your group hello pile number one so whoever has selected this beautiful gopal with this red color heart for today's reading this is your reading so to Hello pile number one. So today for your reading the first card which we got is the distorted feminine. So this uh, distorted feminine talks about you having very very uh, it might be there in the relationship uh, there has been too many negative patterns that has been going on and someone here is living in the past and here uh, distorted feminine that is the energy here that is not uh, living in the present here there is a lot of depression going on and there has been uh, in the life right now there is someone in this connection who is not telling the truth and there is a uh, this is leading to very very unfair expectations either in one or it might be both the parties there might be a blame going going on in this connection hurt and disappointments of the past is not letting you or the other person ask for what they want so that is the energy i'm getting from here so here this is the time to live in the present and not in the past but here someone is stuck in the past because here in this distorted feminine i can uh, feel the energy that someone here was rushing was not knowing what to do because of the hurt because of the uh, past bad experience that they had been experiencing here they were not able to uh, uh, because of the stagnation here the person is not able to move forward still stuck in the past and because of the bad experience uh, trying to withdraw but something here the person anyone in this connection might not be able to fully genuinely express to the other person what is they want because of the fear which they have in their mind and here you can see the devil card so there has been an end in this relationship there has been a end and there has been a change there has been a transition which already happened in the past or right now which is happening and that an acceptance needs to be made from both the parties that there has been an end but uh, someone might have expe accepted this end but there might be still uh, there can be some individuals here who might have not accepted this end or might be finding it difficult to accept this end so here let me remove the charms here let me see the cards first of all 
So as you can see the lover's card, three of cups and we have the dating card. So here this card talks about that is getting to know uh, you time offered that is a dating period which happens uh, that can be considered valuable but sometimes uh, it might not be accepted so here someone in this relationship has been overlooking things and they might have thought it as a party time or they might have thought that it's relaxed time and and they might not have considered many aspects here so that might be the reason here so here there has been a lot of uh, you can see that uh, love here because we got the lover's card here so there might be love here in this relationship a lot of love loyalty and values it might be from one or both and but there might have been someone who tried to overlook the other person they might have completely ignored uh, the qualities of the other person or what they want they might have taken it very lightly they might have taken it as a time to do party and enjoy and relax and they might have completely overlooked some of the red flags some of the qualities of the other person here and we can see that the world uh, might offer a lot of possibilities here there might you need to uh, to be creative or someone is already trying to be creative or someone wants to be creative because I can see that there is excessive boredom there is excessive repetition here and someone here uh, is striving for that enthusiasm someone is very bored here so they long for that lost love the days gone by they feel they miss that old days and because of that they want that uh, they want some excitement that old loss gone period they want to get that back but right now uh, it's not happening it's quite bored or they are trying to get out of that boredom because they miss their old days that days gone by also there has been a lot of uh, authority and a lot of people had been very very rule conscious that is they want to have that authority that strictness they need to, they want to go by the rule and that has uh, they, they want to have that structure and that might have led to a little bit of boredom so someone here wants excitement wants that enthusiasm back so the unique and innovative approach so here you can see the creativity so there is uh, someone feeling the need to be unique to be innovative to have that creative approach and they feel that the world needs something more because they are feeling very bored here right now and they want to formulate something because they are feeling bored they are feeling the need to do something uh, creative so here you can see colors here because here we got the lower scar that means the here there had been a lot of uh, it, it might have been very bright and loving relationship because it's full of color it's you can see the lovers here that means its relationship might have been full of love but here you can see there has been a lot of uh, someone might have ignored the other person's qualities they might have overlooked so there might there should have been some addition which might have been ignored in this relationship and the quality might have been ignored by one of the person because there has been someone who overlooked the other person so purity so because here there was completely ignorance from one side so that was the reason that this situation has arrived so there needs to be purity that purity of expectation purity of uh, expectation and also to see each other in genuine light not to uh, not to make stories here try to find out who is genuine and what are the feelings and how they are as a person so here no so dating period 
you have seen here dating period so try to know each other and then the relationship can survive in true sense and they can be loved but here there has been someone who has been totally ignoring uh, trying to get no the other person or they might have known the other person in the wrong sense so there has been a studio you can see this there has been this devil card which is here so there has been a situation where both the parties might have feel that the relationship has end here and suffering so both the parties have suffered a lot in this relationship because all men's have okay perfection so there has been someone who have tried to become perfect or they might have tried to find out perfection but there has been some bad experience here and because of that bad experience experience that perfection might have been the reason for stagnation or that might have caused someone to withdraw in the situation so complete so completion was not there because of the belief in yourself you believe that there is some bad experience and that might not lead the relationships to survive or would the past person parties might not excel or the relationship might not become an excellent type of relationship because of this uh, suffering from the past bad experience on from the past so there has been uh, some top important things that has been uh, the reason from the past that has led to the breakup situation here from past experiences this relationship has come to this point of suffering because of some top reasons from other relationships too much of expectation perfections and joy there has been a search for joy here in this relationship and what had happened so shoe so this shoe signifies for me leaving something or letting go of some situation and something still there is some cuteness here in this relationship because we feel that here someone is trying to uh, someone is still thinking about the past someone is stuck in the past so this signifies something cute about the relationship something very very cute and uh, that refreshing that perfect period of the relationship someone is living in the past and here someone is trying to be creative here in this relationship and someone is trying to find out that creativity in this relationship but it's stuck okay so it's stuck here someone is trying to jump and get out of this stuck breakup situation but everything is stuck here nothing is moving in that uh, speed because this week is moving very slow and lastly we have this uh, fortune for me it look like fortune for me so it's it's the relationship is going very slow and there is a little bit chance that some creativity might lead to uh, the situation to come out from this uh, authoritative structure but here you can see someone is also trying to let go of this relationship so this is a relationship where there has been some kind of end and someone is trying to come out of that boredom and change because previously the expectation was too high and that expectation lead to an energy which is quite uh, confused and they don't know what to do and they try to do everything but and they are not able to do anything that I can say in one line that they are stagnant and they are stuck because they try to do so much they try to be unique they try to be innovative but at the end they are stuck here they are moving like a tortoise here 
so here let me see some letters so m might be important d might be important okay v five might be important s might be important in this relationship then f might be important c e n o n we have v and lastly we have our f so i can see that there has been a lot of pain in this relationship and someone is not able to breathe because of this so much of pressure here in this relationship i can feel the energy here that someone is trying to complete everything try but they don't know how to do it's a, such a confused type type of energy here so that is your reading pile number one i'm still feeling that nervousness from this pile that someone in this uh, group someone in this relationship is quite nervous about it this relationship whether there is and this and is uh, actually going to resolve or there has not been a complete end but someone is trying to resolve it so i can feel the energy here that someone is feeling that pain here feeling that trying to get out of the situation but it's moving very slow so that is your reading pile number one if it resonates then please comment and subscribe we will see you in the next reading so next we will move to the other pile let me remove it this table hello pile number two if you have selected this beautiful gopal with this cow and this golden color heart so this is going to be a reading to start with first of all we will take this uh, cards here and we will get some of your cups so i will see you with the cards here hello pile number two these are your cards so initially we got this devil card the along with devil card we also got the lover's card and queen of cups and the worthiness card so someone here is able to understand your worthiness so there has been a noise going on so this is also a confirmation that you are in that energy where you are fully aware of how worthy you are you are making that noise noise inside you that is shouting that i am worthy i am worthy enough even if others they don't understand my importance there are no one i am the only one who can decide whether i deserve something so you are realizing your importance even if others they are not so here someone has been very very merciful caring spiritual and intuitive and but they might have faced egoism and some kind of negativity from this relationship and because of that they are now distancing themselves from this situation or this doubt which is there in their life they are detaching from it so yes you have given that final indication that you will not be in it in that situation where you feel that you have to compromise on your worthiness you are not going to compromise so pile number 2 you are in that state you are in that state of mind where you have fully realized your importance and if someone is very egoistic not matching up with your energy if there is any doubt you are going to leave that situation and i can see here you got the yin and yang card so you are trying to find that balance in your life you can see this yin and yang card you are trying to find that harmony in your life so you are ready for a change and you are ready for the reflection and growth in your life and there is a lot of creativity romance beauty 
that has been in your life but because of the dominance controlling nature there has been some problem in your life so now you have decided to move on into spirituality spiritual growth you are moving for your own spiritual growth you are exploring beyond what beliefs and values and ideals that you have got uh, might be from the society or as a child you might have got you got from your surroundings so you're moving beyond that because you are moving upward you can see here this person or this lady is moving upward so you're not restricted to that society's ideal beliefs norms you are gradually lifting up yourself to that spirituality spiritual growth of your life so there is a lot of wisdom you are tolerant and there's a lot of good qualities also but here there is also some confusion depression because here you can see that there has been this love situation from which you're moving on so there is some amount of depression also but you are tolerant you are moving upward pile number two so there is a lot of perfection that is waiting for you and because of that you can see here spirituality maturity and because of that you are very very dear to the lord okay very very good message for you engage so you should engage yourself to spirituality spirituality and see this elephant it's moving towards this spirituality so you in your life has decided to move towards this mountain you can see this mountain you are moving towards this mountain ladder by ladder you are lifting upward in the spiritual growth so there has been a debt here debt of the those doubts and negative emotions you are moving out of this so something has been uh, might have been broken here and the angels protecting you and moving you towards that spiritual growth and fortune is by your side because you are moving towards the spiritual growth so letter c might be important 25 number might be important a x e okay we got a lot of letters f o e okay c r f o and what else here we have v and u so these letters might be important so pile number two this was your reading if it resonates then please comment and subscribe to the channel so i will see you in the next reading those who have selected pile number three that is this beautiful krishna's picture with this charm that is round in shape so this is going to be a reading so let's get some card and then i will explain you what is happening in your love life right now so you see you in your reading hello pile number three so we got here for you the commitment card so here someone is uh, committed or someone wants to be committed in a loving relationship here but there has been some loss here there has been some loss someone wants this relationship but there has been they want this commitment or they are in commitment but there has been some loss there has been this uh, rejection or this poverty coming in they want this commitment but there is not enough resources for this commitment to happen and there is this stagnation and there is a reflection of this situation that this commitment might be difficult because of this uh, situation because there is not enough resources here not enough resources for this relationship, uh, relationship to have a stable ground for that commitment not enough to uh, form that commitment because we don't have that resources and here i can see that someone is trying to provide someone is trying to be the protector you can see this person he is trying to offer roses and he he or she is trying to offer 
all the loving things to, in this relationship but there is not enough resources with this person and because of that i can see that uh, this person is trying to have that courage that uh, integrity he's trying to be the provider but there is some control here there is some rigidity there is rejection and there is poverty there is not enough resources for this person to come in this energy fully to provide that but he is trying he or she is trying to be the provider but there is not enough resources so there is some kind of boredom stubbornness obsession obsession about providing everything to the partner providing all the resources to the partner that is the obsession that is the requirement but here i don't see enough resources with that person he or she might be it can be any of the parties but someone here is trying to provide everything but they don't have with them all those resources so here i can see this boundary card coming in boundary so here someone is trying to reset their boundaries here someone is trying to reset their boundaries here there has been they are trying to move towards a more healthy boundaries here because i could see this lady you might be a female male or female but this doesn't matter so you can see there is this protection here there is this courage here so here uh, you are trying to set boundaries here healthy brown boundaries here but with this knowledge you are moving forward and you are trying to create a boundary but there is some kind of restlessness and some kind of behavior impulsiveness or restlessness which is not letting this happen in this relationship so this is the situation right now that there is not enough to provide to the other party in this relationship there needs to be a healthy boundary here but there is a restlessness there so someone here needs to set that boundary here so you might be waiting you are in the waiting period or there might be a divine timing coming for you and it is it might be that you want that divine timing or it is there waiting for you or something is happening here okay there is a liberation so you want that liberation or liberation is coming for you uh, and here we have this uh, let this sentence here uh, it says that cooling refreshing and purifying so here in this relationship you want to have this energy but there is some kind of restlessness here you need to set your boundaries so that there can be this cooling and refreshing and purifying energy in this relationship so here i can see this angels here protecting you the spirit guides and angels protecting you because i see a lot of angels here lot of angels and lot of guidance coming for you in this charms and your letter o might be important for you f then t o o okay o came three times so that might be significant for you this letters and then we have j okay another o then r d then we have this is letter okay this power button okay so we got a power button here that is something here needs to you need to power up something here because i can see here there is a someone here who doesn't have all the resources so you need to start that power button so that you get all the resources which is required for this commitment to happen okay so there is r here there is this letter again r coming in and s here so this might be letter is important for you so pile number 3 this is your reading so if it resonates then please comment and subscribe to the channel i will see you in the next video next reading so those who have selected this beautiful krishna with cows in the background this reading is for you and let's see in your reading hello pile number 4 so this is your cards so 
here you got the card that is garden here this is the card the first card so you might have been in this energy where you might have been trying to connect to your inner nature your uh, might be to the nature or your nature your own self so here it might be that you are honoring yourself as the beautiful person as you are you are trying to trust and the trusting in your life as it is whatever whatever is happening you're trusting it and you're trying to reconnect to the nature by spending time in nature you can see this lady she is spending time in nature she is trying to take full advantage of this beautiful scenery and in and around her see these mountains and these trees and so here having healthy and connecting to the inner garden and basically connecting to the nature so that is the energy i'm seeing in this pile so here so this is i can see this as a journey that you're trying to take you're trying to take the journey of connecting to yourself in your love life because that is the best lesson that can be learned to love your own self your own nature so you're trying to get to know your own self that is the love you're trying to love your own self that as a i can understand from this card it's also about your own self so here uh, we have this energy of letting go of some past or trying to pause and have uh, ha to try to pause and see what is the situation and try to connect to your own self by pausing by disconnecting from this outer world in and around and pausing and trying to uh, connect to your own self and that is the energy i'm getting in this pile and we also have this forgiveness card as you can they see this forgiveness card card is very uh, significant here because here in life we need to forgive ourselves and we also need to forgive others so this forgiveness is very important because sometimes we don't realize how important it is because if we are not able to forgive ourselves and others then we might not be able to fully enjoy this uh, this energy of connecting to our own self we might not be able to connect to our own self because there might be some guilt and we need to release that guilt everything might not be in our hands so here this is the message that is happening right now that there is a uh, there is this uh, energy that you need to forgive yourself and others and you need to create more space for light and love to flow in and any kind of guilt you need to let go you need to repeat uh, this mantra of forgiveness that i forgive myself i forgive myself i forgive myself and i am forgiven so that is the message and here any kind of uh, conflict that had happened because here forgiveness was not there and it led to a lot of conflict because here you might have had to deal with some egoism and some negative energy and you might not have been able to forgive or any of the party might not have been able to forgive it can be uh, either side so someone here has not been able to forgive and that had led to a lot of conflict here in this relationship and you can see that now here there is this responsibility that has been taken or it's going to be taken so this is the justice card that means justice should be served that is the card of truth and responsibility so you might be demanding uh, responsibility or truth you might be uh, trying to get the truth try to trying to understand what is the truth and here I have, you can see this very beautiful card that is emotional freedom you can see this energy this energy is very very beautiful 
see this energy that means here we are trying to have that true emotional freedom that is liberating that is uh, embracing individuality in ourselves and in others we are all different and we need to accept ourselves we need to accept others we need to forgive and we need to connect to our inner self here so here this energy because here you are trying to embrace this energy or you are moving into this energy or you have embraced this energy so that has led to a lot of advancement opportunities and wealth in your life material wealth or it can be related to your relationship so a lot of good connection and wealth is coming because you are trying to embrace your individuality and the individuality of others you know that you are different others are different you're trying to forgive and you're trying to connect to your inner self and because of that this energy is coming that is the energy of having wealth and opportunity and all type of material things in life and here is fullness coming for you and there is this energy of empress that is i can see this feminine energy uh, that is full of nature you can see even the first card is about nature that means you're connecting to your inner self and now you're getting that uh, completeness you're able to achieve that completeness in yourself uh, you know that you don't need a relationship to define yourself because you have embraced your own self you are having that relationship with your own self you're trying to have that relationship with your own self you're trying to forgive forgive others and yourself in this relationship so the message that is you are trying to shine here by forgiving you're trying to forgive or you have already forgiven or there is energy where you are moving towards this forgiveness and this is you need to ignore an allergy ignoring an allergy can be life threatening so if you are ignoring this forgiveness forgiving yourself and others then that can be very dangerous you need to forgive otherwise this progress towards this emotional freedom and towards this wealth and this fullness and this energy that is shining energy might not be possible if you are not uh, if you're not dealing with that forgiveness that is there allergy i'm talking about that is you need to forgive others and yourself and the number which might be important is 2012 or two might be important zero might be important one might be important or even five might be important here so a lot of charms came that is i'm taking this charms there are a lot of animal charms here for you butterflies cat even we have this uh sea animals here see this this is a peacock so a lot of animals here and this all signifies for me spirituality and growth and uh, here also we can see that you are trying to embrace your inner your inner self your individual individuality your uh, inner self here even fruits came up but i said previously you are trying to connect to the nature so a lot of fruits and animals here wow pile number four a lot of fruits and yeah all the animals came here you can see all animals and very very surprised how come yeah all animals you see here pile number four even mermaid okay so you are trying to connect to your inner self here in your garden your own garden which is a lot of fruit which has a lot of fruits and animals and plants and trees that is nature you're trying to connect to the nature your own self you're enjoying the fruit of connecting to your own self because here you are trying to form that relationship with your own self and forgiving everyone forgiving even others and forgiving yourself by by this change by accept accepting this change that is for you pile number four so if this resonate pile number four then please comment and subscribe to the channel 
hello pile number five if you have selected this picture along with this blue color heart then this is your reading see you with the cards hello pile number five so this is your card so here I can see that <coughs> You are waiting for the timing, that perfect timing. So you might have been waiting for your dreams to come true. So timing is very important here in your love life. And because of that, uh, there might be some friends, there's some community where there is some celebration going on and some creativity here. But you are trying to be defensive towards that celebration or you are not enjoying because you are thinking only about that perfect timing that divine timing so here and this is the energy i am getting and there has been <clears throat> you have been waiting for the result time here and everything has been moving quite slow for you so here that is the energy where you are looking for the result time and you are not able to connect with the celebration which is happening in and around you in your community or in your friend circle because you are waiting for your dreams to come true in your life so because of that energy you are not able to enjoy the celebration time which is happening in your community and you're quite defensive and towards and quite cautious towards and that is leading to slow uh, like there is some slow movement in your life here I can see that uh, there has been uh, some compromise that has happened or there is no need to compromise in your part you should not compromise or there has been some compromise that you had to deal with so you might have compromised yourself in the past or in the present but now is the time to maintain your self-respect because here we see that uh, you are accepting the change and you are moving you're taking action towards that moving into meditation and understanding yourself because self-respect is very important so you are understanding the importance of getting self-respect respecting your own self and also getting that respect from others so here you can see that uh, some details might be important for you here to um, to get into that meditation stage you might have to find out what is the detail or you need to go through some details to actually uh, meditate and i can see here the next card is about the sacred woman so here there is this energy that uh, the willpower and the um, that you must be respected so but there is also that fear that if you demand for respect then the other party might leave but it is always important that to know that if the other party is uh, deserving then they are going to respect and you don't need to have that defensiveness in yourself that if you demand for self-respect then the other party will leave of course if the person is not deserving that person will leave but that is the sadness which you carry which, are, which you are carrying, that headache which you are carrying, the sadness which you are carrying, the grief which you are carrying in your life, that is the sadness about being, being not getting that respect if you demand for that respect. So you are being defensive and that lead to this heartbreak, that lead to this grief. So here is that message that everything is going to be fine, you will move out of this heartbreak because you have the key. You don't have to search for the key from other person. You don't have to get the valid validation from the other person. You have your self-respect. You don't need to demand self-respect because you are the power here. You have everything in yourself. You are the both the 
male and female that energy the balance energy you have within yourself both a male and female energy we you have within yourself you just need to balance it out you don't have to search for that extra validation from other person you don't have if they are not giving you the self-respect that means they don't deserve you so that is the energy i'm getting here some of the letters which might be important is h g h o c v and the number one so these are some letters which might be important so this is your reading pile number five so if this resonates then please comment and subscribe to the channel those who have selected this beautiful picture of krishna with this charm that is ganesh charm this is pile number six so this reading is for you i will see with you you with your cards hello pile number six so this is your cards and we first of all got this card of maturity here so here you are becoming more mature uh, you are taking responsibility of your own happiness you can see this this lady she is writing she is doing her work she is taking responsibility for her own work for her own happiness so you don't want anything which is fake you want everything genuine and you want everything real because of uh, because you have taken responsibility of your own life you have taken your own life in your own hand here so here So here there is this card calling you that you need to have the courage and you need to move out of this uh, if you are in any kind of con uh, influence then you need to uh, come out of that influence and you need to have your own control because there has been some calling here that you need to show the courage and you need to have your own control. You need to have your own devotion because you need to get out of that influence which is affecting you because here you have been wanting a new beginning you are calling you can see this uh, person this child is calling out so you have been calling out for a new beginning you want that creativity enthusiasm in your life so you are waiting for that perfection and in the past uh, you might have not been happy with that because you uh, didn't follow the safety instruction which was there you didn't show you didn't had that uh, you didn't uh, get that genuinity uh, genuine persons in around in your life but right now you are uh, find, trying to find out and you're calling out for a new beginning and there is an updated version of this so here something has been updated or you want something updated because here you are taking responsibility your own happiness and you want everything updated because you want everything genuine and real and you have been manifesting it you are visualizing what you want you can see this lady she is trying to balance it out her energy so she is trying to visualize what she or he wants uh, that is you are trying to attract what you want in your life uh, so that uh, and you have that energy within you that is available because universe is giving this to you so here um, you need to view uh, but you are not viewing something which might be you might be completely ignorant, ignorant about something because uh, some offering is there but you might not be viewing it so uh, you want to accomplish something you are taking the responsibility but it is leading to extra burden because you're not viewing something there is some offer coming but you're not viewing it you, there is something which is hidden and you don't know about it and that is uh, might be the problem here uh, and here as you can see this card 
this card is very beautiful card you got this very beautiful class so here you're trying to gracefully handle everything whatever is happening in your life in your love life you're trying to gracefully handle everything and there has been some regret here there has been some disappointment but uh, you're trying to gracefully handle everything and there has been also some energy where uh, there has been some impulsive behavior or there has been some uh, adventure or some energy where uh, there has been a need to let go of the negativity there has been the need to light up and remove the darkness and to get to the energy of Diwali that is the festival of light and to be in the present movement and there has been that energy that you uh, there is an association between the two there is a this is because this, is a, this reading is about relationship so there is an association between you two and there is a confirmation that everything is going to be fine in your life but you should not ignore whatever energy is there that is whatever is the problem in your life because you need to find out what is genuine and you should not ignore it because that might be a serious problem in future because if you're ignoring it so there is a lot of wisdom here and you are attracting a lot of wisdom here and everything is moving slow but at least it is moving in the right direction so here all men's have so here you are trying to find out what qualities that person has whether they are genuine or not you are trying to find out what qualities they have what qualities are there in the other person you're trying to find out and so you are praying because here there is a manifestation card so you are praying for whatever you want in your life so you're trying to recall record and read other people so that you can find out who is genuine and who is not genuine in your life so some of the letters which might be important in your life is f i v and we have this letter g o and we have s and then we have h e p and lastly we have our letter that is uh, we have letter L here so these are the letters which might be important so this is your reading file number six if it resonates then please comment and please subscribe to the channel thank you for watching this video